Now, cancer is a devastating illness, but when it's your child suffering, the pain is all the worse. Two-year-old Lola May has been diagnosed with Wilms tuna on both kidneys. The disease means one of her kidneys will have to be removed and the other cleaned of all cysts and tumours with the possibility of a kidney transplant in the future. But to support Lola's family and to raise money for Southampton General and QA hospitals who are treating her, a charity bike ride is being organised starting from the village of West Meon and finishing up at Southampton General Hospital. And I'm delighted to say that fundraisers Adam Jones, Brett New and Jason Armitage join me in the studio. Thanks so much for coming in, guys. So tell us a bit, if I start with you, Adam, just tell me a bit about why you've decided to raise money for this cause. Yeah, definitely. So, I mean, I've had a personal experience with both QA, uh, neonatal, as well as Southampton General, um, with my own son, George, who has a shunt fitted. Um, he was quite, well, like Lola, he was quite young um, when he was admitted to both wards. Uh, so it's, um, I find it's a matter that's quite close to home, um, you know, and I just think, you know, the opportunity to, to help out both wards and gain more recognition for them, I just wasn't able to really pass it up. And uh, kind of, you're all bikers, you're wearing your leathers. Tell us a bit about what's, what's going on, what are you doing? Well, um, about the charity, yeah, event, yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, we're hoping to uh, try and uh, like raise as much as we can for the charity itself. Um, we're estimating about three grand if we can raise that much. Uh, basically, um, we're going to try and do our best that we can um, to get as much funds as we can to support cancer. And um, you're organising, it's a bike ride, so there's going to be kind of, how many people do you think there'll be, Adam, on, the, on this? Yeah, I mean, we're estimated at the moment about 150 people. 150 um, bikers, 150 all on bikes, bikes right. Yeah. <laughs> so a lot of people, but that, I mean, that's just based off the interest of the Facebook um, ride out page. I mean, you know, as you guys know, yeah. they'll, bring, yeah. they'll bring their friends with them. It's going to be it's going to be quite it's going to be quite big. It's uh, definitely going to cause a stir in the area. Um, however, I have, I have been in touch with Hampshire Constabulary, who have um, said that they'll send out some police riders as well to assist us, um, as well as obviously ride for the causes. It's something that they feel quite strongly about as well. And Jason, you're kind of part of this biking community. Seems yeah. like you're all sort of joining together. Tell us a bit about what the community's like. Uh, the community is quite a good one, to be honest. This. It was like a family, you know. Obviously, this, uh, well, this, I don't know how to explain it, but obviously, what's happened to Lola has brought everyone together, you know, like all, even like um, Hell's Angels, they've come in and they've shown their support for her. I mean, it's going to, to show our support as well, we're going to be riding around and like pepper pigs on our bike, or we're going to get costumes, you know. Um, She's two years old, is what was said, and she can't do it on her own, so if she knows she's got us behind her, might just give her that, yeah, I can do this sort of attitude, you know? It's, and it'd be nice to see a smile on her face for that day as well. So, but it is, it's a pretty big family, to be honest, it is. <laughs> yeah, and because I mean, some people would say, well, bye, because they're all really hard and unemotive <laughs> and they're not going to be, you know, touched by obviously this uh, terrible illness that's affecting yeah. this little girl. And yet here you all are kind of coming together to raise money. Yeah, of course. I mean, obviously, bikers in general, you know, we're, we're given that kind of stereotypical image where it's like, yeah. you know, yeah. we're a bit with big, bold and brash. And I mean, at the end of the day, you know, we're, we're people's family as well. I mean, at the end of the day, there's no diff difference between me and you. I mean, I just think it's that it's that image from like you know what the media portrays us at, and you know at the end of the day we're all quite big and cuddly really. We've all yeah. got big soft hearts, yeah, yeah. so it's like you know, at the end of the day, any chance to get get in with fundraising, you know, just help out. So tell me a bit about the route more specifically. Yeah, definitely. So I mean, it starts from Leamy's Motorcycle Cafe um, out in the west by the West Meon Hut. Yeah. Um, and what we're going to be doing is we're going to be uh, after we come out of Leamy's. We're going to take our left and then we're going to go down through Brandy, um, where then we're going to come into Winchester. We're going to have a, a massive ride out that's going to go through the town. Uh, and then we're going to get carry on straight down past the Royal Hampshire King Hospital. Okay. Um, we'll then continue up into Waterbourne and through Eastleigh, um, mm -hmm. obviously avoiding the motorway because there are going to be people there like, like us who aren't going to be able to use the motorway. Um, and then from Eastleigh we're going to carry on straight down um, 
up into by the Southampton general. Where then there's going to be a select few of us that are going to be, um, you know, we're going to go into the general itself, uh, and then the re the rest of us would be a bit closer to the date. We're going to find somewhere to gather, and then from there we're all going to go from the meeting place uh, from the general down through Portsmouth over Portsdown Hill, down the A3, uh, back up by Petersfield, and then come back into Lumi, so it's going to be quite a big circle. Okay, so kind of a huge loop there yeah. going on all through the Solent area. Yeah, definitely. And um, you're not worried about kind of clogging up the roads or anything? Well, I, we, I have, mean, we have like, um, we have marshals, which okay. I'm going to be one of them. We're going to be uh, going along, make sure everyone's riding safely, also making sure that no, no one falls behind, so we're staying in one big group, um, keeping everything legalised, yeah. no stupid stunts or anything like that. Yeah. I mean, obviously, the amount of people that we're expecting to come, there is going to be, you know, we admit there is, it is going to cause disruption. However, we're going we're gonna to try to arrange the, uh, the route through Portsmouth um, to avoid, obviously, as little disruption as, as really possible. Okay. And um, just finally, if someone's watching this and they think, what a great cause, you know, what a lovely, but, you know, poor little girl, how can they help? How can they give them give some money? Yeah, definitely. So, I mean, if, you know, if you want to get involved, then, um, you know, just make sure you're at Loomis on Saturday, the 12th of March. Um, right, so people can still come and yeah, ride along if yeah, they want to. Yeah, okay. more, more than welcome. You know, welcome anything from, you know, cruisers to sports bikes to even, even scooters. You know, if, okay. if, it doesn't matter what you want. I don't know what those are. <laughs> <laughs> Mopeds. Mopeds. Okay. Yeah. But, you know, if, if you feel, you know, you want to get involved, then come to Loomis for 10 o'clock on Saturday, the 12th. You know, we're all going to be there. You know, it's going to be a big event, you know. And maybe, you know, if you don't ride bikes or say you can't at the moment, you know, we have got a Just Giving page as well that, you know, you're more than welcome to donate to. Any bikers that say can't make it on the day, um, we are selecting anyone who donates £5 or over, um, putting them in for a chance to win a free all expenses paid track day. At, uh, wow. Goodwood. OK. So, you now, there's lots of ways that the community can get involved. Yeah. So, yeah. Cool. So they'll just search for, is it Lola May on yeah, Just Giving? Yeah, okay. you Lola May, you'll, you'll find it pop up on there. All right, guys. Well, thanks so much for coming in and telling us all about it. And good luck on the day and good luck with the fundraising as Thank well. Thank you for the opportunity to get it out. Thank you.